Hello, so I would like to create this video um, to show you how to utilize your um, LinkedIn account. So I already have a previous video um, showing you how you can sign up or, or what you need to do to, um, to make your LinkedIn account your resume. So now naman, I would like to uh, show you some important details or some important thing about uh, settings pala, kung anong mga important settings na bag kailangan yung baguhin or i-personalize sa inyong LinkedIn account. So, um, unang-una, kailangan nakalogin ka sa website, sa desktop, not on your cellphone, kasi minsan sa phone, um, hindi mo makikita lahat ng options. So, um, ngayon, nandito tayo sa profile ko and this is my um, this is my uh, account dito sa website. Uh, kung nakikita nyo, di ba nandito tayo sa profile. Um, by the way nga pala, ito ulit yung how you can edit your public profile and URL. Pag kinlik mo to, um, ito, pwede mong i-personalize yung iyong uh, URL. So, for example, linkedin.com slash in slash virtual assistant Eden. So, yun yung makikita nila sa sa URL or yung sa, yun nandito sa taas. Kasi ang, uh, usually, ang makikita dyan is parang jumbled letters, di ba? So, pwede nyo i-personalize yan. So, pwede nyo ilagay yung name nyo, um, personalize nyo para mas magandang tingnan or mas madaling, kumbaga mas madali na lang siyang um, i-send or i-copy kung, let's say, kung may kausap kayong client, at least alam nyo na kung anong URL nyo. Ang itatype nyo lang, linkedin.com slash in slash kung ano man yung personalized URL nyo. So, that's it. And, of course, um, ito, yung visibility ng profile nyo. Pwede nyo i-private, pwede nyo i-public. So, ako ngayon naka-private ako. Um... So, para hindi lahat as is makaka-search ng profile nyo. And, what else? So, siguro i-public ko na lang ulit. So, that's it. And then, uh, ayan. Makikita nyo yung mga ways on how you can uh, personalize. How you can personalize your account. Now, let's go to, let's go back to LinkedIn. Click natin tong me. Di ba yung me? Under me, select nyo yung settings and privacy. Okay? So, again, settings and privacy. Um, isa to sa, isa sa mga pinaka-importante na kailangan yung baguhin or i-personalize. So, punta muna tayo sa account. Pagka-click nyo nun, punta kayo sa account. So, ito yung mga details about your um, logins, logins and security, Pwede nyo i-personalize yung feed nyo. Um, ito yung sa name nyo. How your name and other profile field, fields appear to other members. Um, ngayon, punta kayo sa uh, account management. Uh, not that one, sorry. Preferences. Okay, so I think yun na yun dito banda sa part ng, ano, no, ng account. Um, dito tayo, balik tayo sa privacy. So, again, dito sa account, again, personalize nyo yung, um, uh, ayan, yung password nyo, pwede nyo baguhin, uh, ano pa ba, security, yung mga verification, um, feed preferences, yon So, hanggang dyan lang naman. Um, next is yung privacy. Ito, um, pwede nyong i-search or i-edit pala. I-edit yung public profile nyo. It says here, choose how your profile appears to non-login members via, via search engines or permitted services. Kung baga, pag sinesearch ka nila um, or pag nakita ka nila sa mga, uh, let's say, Google searches, pwede nyong i-personalize kung paano nyo gusto makita yung, yung profile nyo dun. Next is, uh, or let's say, kapag hindi sila log in sa LinkedIn. Um, pwede nyong baguhin kung sino makakita ng email address nyo. Of course, you want this to be public. Uh, if someone can, let's see. Okay, so dito, makikita nyo kung sino. Pwede nyong i-private, which is only you lang. Pwede first and second degree connections. 
pwede ring anyone. So, kumbaga, naka-public siya. Kumbaga, sa Facebook, ito, naka-public. Ito, naka-friends. Um, yun. And then, what else? Allow your connections to, down your, to, to download your email. Uh, ito yung sa mga lead generation. Di ba, merong mga nag-lead gen using LinkedIn na pwede nilang i-download yung, um, yung email info nyo sa isang Excel sheet. So, if you want your email to be included on their uh, report, um, you can just select yes, pero pwede ring no. Who can see your connection? So, ako, naka-private yung connections ko. Uh, pwede rin namang i-public yan. So, meaning, um, sino ba yung mga clients or yung mga, yung mga nag-connect? Kumbaga sa Facebook ulit, sino yung makakita ng friends list mo? Parang ganon. Ito naman, um, viewers of this profile also viewed. Kumbaga, parang um, yun yung mga suggestions na nakikita nyo sa, may, sa gilid or sa baba. Next, who can see your last name? Um... Representing your organization and interest. Yung mga interest, yung mga pinag, uh, yung mga nilalike nyo na mga group or, or let's say company profiles, makikita yon Profile visibility of LinkedIn. Um, choose how your profile appears by partners and other permitted services. So, parang tulad din nung isa, uh, makikita kung, uh, I mean, you can change how your profile appears daw. Um, next is Microsoft Word. Uh, choose whether work experience descriptions from your LinkedIn profile can be shown in Resume Assistance. Assistant, a feature within Microsoft Word. So, ito, maganda to Gawin nyo to I-yes nyo dapat yan. Next is, um, how others see your link LinkedIn activity. So, ito, basta ipipersonalize nyo lang yan. Um, ano, titignan kung ano yung sa, sa pinaka-importante dito. Manage active status. Um, choose who can see when you are on LinkedIn. So, makikita kung, titignan ko nga kung naka, okay, so, naka-private talaga yung aking account. So, kung kayo ay actively looking for a job, lagi nyong, syempre, ayaw nyo i-private yan, di ba? Ako namin kasi, hindi naman ako actively looking. So, kaya ko pin-private yung aking mga settings. And, yeah, so, personalize nyo lang tong mga to. Um, and then, ano pa ba? Let's see. What else? Share job changes, education changes. So, ito yung mga um, nasa bab bandang baba, yung nasa education and job uh, info. Ano pa ba? Um, mentions or tags by others. Choose whether other members can mention or tag you. Hmm, get copy of your data. Let me check. Okay, so manage who can discover your profile from your phone number. So, kumbaga, kung itatype nila yung phone number mo, makikita nila yung um, profile mo. Kung yun yung number na nilagay mo dun sa pag-sign up mo dito. So, um, you can change it to everyone or whoever. Second degree connections or nobody. So, yan. And then, what else? Hmm... Yan, so para ka lang um para mo lang pinipersonalize yung ano mo no, yung parang parang Facebook account mo. Pero ito mas marami siya, mas marami kang pwedeng uh, gawin dito. Dito naman sa communications um yan, yung notifications. Kung gusto niyo may pop-up sa device no, change niyo lang tong settings nito. Um, conversation or gusto nyo ba yung conversation lang yung merong notif and i-turn off nyo yung mga news, profile, network jobs or pwede rin namang conversations and jobs lang ang may uh, notification and the rest i-turn off nyo. And kasi minsan di ba may magme-message sa atin na client, minsan hindi natin napapansin na meron na palang nag-message yun pala naka-turn off yung inyong um, notification. So, who can reach you uh, kung sino ang pwedeng mag in Ito na yung nakikita nyo na minsan pag mag-prospect mag kayo ng client, minsan hindi nyo makonect, diba? There's no option to connect. Nakalagay lang message. So, ibig sabihin, um, pin-personalize nila dito, pin-private nila. So, who can connect with you? Nakalagay sa akin, everyone can connect with me. Um, invitations from your network, uh, messages, allow people to message you. 
Um, yeah, so that's it. Uh, let's see kung meron pa ba. Um, eto, reply suggestions. Ito yung makikita nyo na pag nagme-message kayo sa LinkedIn, di ba? Um, usually may sinasuggest silang mga response. So, pwede nyo i-turn off. So, ayun lang. And I gusto ko lang i-share kasi yung iba hindi nila alam na may mga ganitong options. So, yeah. That's it. And uh, start personalizing your LinkedIn account. Thank you.